Hello students, welcome to Sorosa classes. For detailed information about our classes, you can visit our website that is www.sorosaclasses.com and if you need study materials and full videos of our courses, then you can just call us or WhatsApp us at this number 9836-793076. You can even like our videos and subscribe our channel for further more videos. Today our topic is objective commerce and here is our first question. The question is from the following particulars of Mrs. Dropadi Limited. Here some informations are given that is monthly cash requirement is 60,000. Fixed cost per transaction is rupees 10. Interest rate on marketable securities is 6% per annum. Now, we have to calculate the optimum cash balance of the company. Here four options are given. So now let's start. Optimum cash balance. Optimum cash balance. Is equals to. Root over. 2b t by i now putting the values we can rewrite it as this equals to 2 b is 10 that is given in the question and t is 60,000 that is also given in the question and the rate of interest is zero point zero zero five this is equals to rupees fifteen thousand four hundred ninety two or rupees fifteen thousand. So here we can take I that was given in the question as six percent or zero point five percent per month so here i is equals to 0 0.005 so our answer is 15,000 that is option c so the optimum cash balance of the company is 15,000 now our next question is the dfl of a first of a firm is 1.61 EBIT is rupees 25,000 and the interest component is rupees 7,000. The dividend on preference shares that the firm paid assuming a tax rate of, so the tax rate is 30% is also given. Now we have to find the dividend on preference shares here. Five options are given, so now let's start. DFL is equals to EBIT divided by EBIT minus one minus DP by one minus now putting the values we can rewrite it as DFL is equals to 25,000 that was given in the question is EBIT divided by 25,000 minus 7,000 minus DP divided by 1 minus 0 0.30 now solving this we can get dp that is the dividend on preference is dp that is equals to 1730 so the dividend on preference shares 
that the firm paid assuming a tax rate of 30 percent is 1730 that is option a so option a is our answer